I always have a carry-on just so that I can, um, and it's a, just a good quality carry-on. It can match the luggage or it can just be something uh, like this cotton carry-on. Uh, and you can always, always, always pack each thing in a plastic cleaner's bag. This really prevents a lot of um, wrinkling. And uh, I also like to hang my coat in here if I'm uh, carrying a coat on the plane. Uh, and I, they, stewardess is nice enough usually to hang it in the closet. And this can be folded up. If you fold this a couple times, it doesn't really uh, wrinkle anything. Uh, and you can roll it up on top of your rollie. And the airlines are allowing that. Now, this little suitcase, uh, inexpensive, uh, very nice long handle, and I'm tall and I need a long handle, uh, but this is adjustable, different heights uh, for even a little kid can pull this suitcase. has very good wheels on it, and it's a nice material. It won't get um, too dirty and it won't get damaged, which is something else you should look for, and it's very roomy. So um, we have, uh, for my trip, I have a couple sweaters. Sweaters should be uh, folded if you want to pretty much ensure that they won't be wrinkled. Use a piece of tissue paper inside like that and fold this. The less uh, number, the fewer folds, the better. So that has only one fold basically right here. And this is um, another sweater that I'm going to be taking. Some little under shirts to wear underneath the sweaters. They can go here. A couple nice blouses. Uh, all folded like men's shirts, uh, and there's a little tissue in them. It really does help the, help the um, uh, wrinkling. Uh, shoe bags are very nice to have for each shoe or each pair of shoe. I like single because then I can put the shoes together like this, and they don't get squashed or hurt. And shoes are expensive, and you want to take good care of them. These go in the bottom of the suitcase, crosswise like this. And, hmm, they forgot my nightgown. Hmm. <laughs> and my underwear. <laughs> Don't forget that because, and a bathing suit if you're going to Florida, you have to have a bathing suit. Obviously, this is only for example. So, little stockings, lots of stockings and no um, these, this can go here because I don't care if that gets a little bit wrinkled. Try to make it in flat layers. My pants fold it in thirds like this. My sweaters. Now for carrying on your other things, your toiletries um, and uh, your little computer, your iPad, whatever, these are great bags. This, oh, by the way, this suitcase and this bag which folds into that bag, but then this can be used for toiletries or makeup. Uh, they all come from Muji, and they're very inexpensive and very well made. My daughter Alexis travels with the baby uh, with four of these bags only. That's it, four. Everything fits in there, including toys. And um, then this, these little makeup bags, these are like $7 and they hold uh, lots of things, and they're washable. You can throw them. If they get stained in any way, you can just throw them in the, di in the washing machine, uh, and they wash and come out white. They're very nice. So you have to decant because of that seven, uh, that rule, um, anything over four ounces. Mario Badescu sells uh, the large amount, and then you decant into the smaller, and mark clearly what they are. These will fit nicely right into a case like this. Uh, you can put in your creams, your face creams. I love my Revitalin day cream and my chamomile eye cream and little travel sizes of other creams. Look how big this becomes. So you can really pack a lot in here. Uh, and this goes right on top of that. Uh, and this will be my little bag. Uh, these wallets are great for all your credit cards, your money, your passports, and these can double as a little evening purse. And that's what I use. Now, oh, that's all, that's Muji too. And basically, I'm ready to go. I fold, I roll that up on top of this and I'm ready to go.